Howdy guys, in today's video we're going to be looking at how to add and remove sheets from your um, parts and sheets panel. But before that, let's have a quick intro first. So today's video can be found on softwaretraining.co.za. We make short and easy to watch problem solving videos and we also have daily updates. Otherwise we head back into the program here. Now this will be the last little section we look at on this um, parts and sheets panel and that will be adding and removing sheets. Now at the bottom left here where we find the information this will also be the current sheet. So now this works similar to your um, adding and removing parts you can say to the, the actual parts in the sense of the buttons but they look slightly different so we if we had to look next to the sheets here we see we've got a little plus a little minus so obviously this means add and this one means remove so we'll start with adding we click on this it will pop up a new sheet uh, panel i'm just going to leave everything at is except for the diameter so just so i can add it say okay and now we can see here at the bottom left under the information that we've got a new sheet nothing's being used and you can also obviously swap between them by selecting them now you can also obviously click the sheet and then you click the minus and this will remove that sheet from the list so as you can see we only have one now I'm not sure why it has not updated it but um yeah in my opinion i found that uh sheets at, at the bottom here can be a bit buggy it might just be that uh, it's lack of information on my behalf so i'll definitely look more into that in the future to see is there something i'm missing and uh yeah otherwise that is it we also have this clear button at the bottom which once again you can imagine what that does i click that and it clears it all now um yeah that is it on the sheets adding and removing them and the mini series so yeah thank you guys for following along i hope this was useful otherwise in the meanwhile before we head to our next mini series if you guys go to softwaretraining.co.za you will notice we've got a variety of different softwares we do cover and you can also isolate your search on the top right if you do not however find the training videos you're looking for just simply go here request a training video fill in the mini form and then we'll do our best to try and make that for you but otherwise thanks guys for watching and cheers